Rex says it's best not to think about stuff. Huh. I'm gonna try that. Welcome all my fellow and future outlaws. I'm the NK aka Double G. It's Starlight Week and we got another great opening for you today. We got, uh, what? 10 Blazing Vortex? 11, I think? 3 First Edition Rising Rampage and 1 Precious First Edition Rise of the Duelist Blister. Hopefully we can pull a Starlight. Honestly, I hope we can just pull a Seeker from this. That would be incredible because just this set became so stacked over time. Why the hell did it not get an unlimited printing? Well, let's push this back for that giveaway as we do that Patreon Power Pack. Leave a comment below. Hit that like. 20 of each will unlock this giveaway. $2 through the Patreon will join the Discord. And $20 through the Patreon will get you one of these as well as some, discount, as well as some discounts on the stuff I sell. One of these a month. And uh, yeah, hope we can get a good community going. Plenty of tournaments and all that good stuff along the way for free packs and stuff. And stuff and stuff. But uh, we got some good packs to open up here today. You know I love random packs compared to boxes. The Phantom Rage boxes aren't doing us so hot. So hopefully we can pull some of that pot. Reinforcements. Linear Equation. Armed Dragon. Spriggan's Rocky. And we're starting off with a Secret Rare. Already. And unfortunately, it's the third freaking underdog that I've pulled in like a week. Because it's the worst secret rare, or one of them. But at least we started off with a secret rare. I don't know if I'm happy. <laughs> I've pulled so many Joey Wheelers. Parametal Foes, Mel Caster, Dual Avatar, Melroy, Linear Equation, War Rock, Gactos. It's the first time I've seen that one, at least. Breath of Acclamation, and a Fabled Realm. The stairway to it is here. Starlight week is a tough week. Why are you yelling? War Rock, Giga Thunder. We have another, oh wait, it's the Super Every Time. Sacred Tree Beast, Hyperton. I actually don't mind his name. They actually, like, I really think they put a lot of effort into the artwork on the monsters in this set. I'm just noticing, just comparatively to other sets that have, like, I'm actually paying attention to it, which says something. What, what is this white baking? What is this? I have never seen this card. I know, it's really weird. My cats are being loud. I've never seen that card. It might be one of, it might be like in my top five now. If you're not baking white things, then it's not right, I guess. I don't know, there's a joke in there. S-Force Plotina, dude. Yeah, she's kind of hot. I, that, I mean, that's got to be worth something, you think? Although the S forces don't seem to be worth much, but we pulled a secret and an ultra in four packs. Do you know why I like loose packs better than boxes now? You gotta do it. You gotta do it. Icy Breen, ref Icy Breen, Icy Breeze, Refrain, Jesus. Skylar, S force, Spriggan's Watch. Nothing on that one. Staff of Despair. Come on, Trishula. You're only one out of 588 out of four. Come on. War Rock. Gigant of Thunder. Dogmatic. <laughs> Parametal Foes. Azortless. Haven't seen that one. What the f What is he eating? Is anyone out? Like, he's eating like a baby fucking KO from Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. And I don't care if the game calls it Chow. KO without the S, or Chaos without the S is KO. And I will never give that up. Marcosia, Guitar Grenards, S Force Orifice. S Force probably should have had a better name. Really? Orifice? They knew what they were doing. Pendulum Encore, Knight of Armor or something. Fabled Marcosia. Tao Tao, Anima Juki, Fabled Realm, Tri Brigade, and more despair. All right, two more packs, and then we'll get into our blisters. Icy Breeze, Refrain, Neroy, the Dream Mirror, War Rock, S Force, and a Caduceus, which I do love the way that card looks. Fortunately, it's not great. All right, 
Last pack. Where's my pot? I need that pot. Give me the pot. You don't want me to run low, do you? How could I be entertaining without pot? Hyperterion, that is not pot. Breath of acclimation, breath of pot. All right, an ultra and a secret from nine packs. Eh, probably could have been a little better. Or from 10 packs. Hopefully we can pick it up. Free first edition Rising Rampage. Appalooza? 20, what is it, like a $2,000 card now? Something like that. So that'd be cool. That'd just be like by far the most expensive pull on the channel. I mean, when I pulled Dark Magician for, what was it, Hey, I'm Training, I think. It was like the next day is when it went up to 1400 So you can imagine some feelings of regret for selling that display for $100. But that's okay. It was a good day. It was a good day. So let's return to the normal times when we pull. That is not. That's not a starlight. Fortune Lady Pass. Fuma Wave. Set Uppercut. What's up, Cesaro? He loves uppercuts. Lamia. Lamia. One more. Or two more. Rising Rampage, you know you wanna, Reversal Beetle. Hey, we got a, oh no, oh no. Go! That's like one of the worst secrets you can pull in any set ever. It's so bad. I'm, I'm almost positive, it's like not even a dollar. Oh man, Vessel for Dragon Cycle. We pulled a secret rare out of three packs, and it was a cap shell. I'm almost positive it's not even a dollar. Some more Egberta beginning. I'm beginning to, Jesus, I'm beginning to think there's something wrong. We actually pulled a Romulus again. Are you kidding me? Three packs, and we pulled a secret and an ultra? I'm fine with that. Those are good raids. Romulus ain't too bad. It's like $3. Not too bad. <laughs> Freaking cap shell. Really? <laughs> cap shell? All right, time for what has become a very precious pack. Rise of the Duelist. I have not opened this since the summer. Because it has so many biggies. Can we pull one of the three big magic cards? Probably not, but we're gonna try. Melpy Tag, Fury, Dogmatica, Galloping Gaia, Gaia the Fierce Knight Origin, of course. So much Gaia, but it's not even the Gaia we want. We want Gaia, but not that Gaia. All right, well, we had a what? 15 packs, two secrets, two ultras. That's not the worst rates. Unfortunately, our particular polls were underwhelming. So this has been Starlight Week. We have one Phantom Rage box left for tomorrow. We praying. We praying. And then we pray some more because I don't buy booster boxes anymore. I'm never, nope, I'm done. Random packs for life. See ya.